Hello everybody, welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode. For your service to Sky City, I grant you these gifts. To the Eversource. Really? That's what you're focusing on? I'd say we have bigger problems on our hands. Like Aiden. Look at him, all friendly with the founder. Hmm. That's bad news. Ivor's right. Uh, the Eversource is what matters. It's just kind of what we brought us here. Take your reward and enjoy the bounty of Sky City's generosity. Carrots? Really? You gotta be kidding. We are honored, wonderful founder. Of course. Now go. I have criminals to deal with. Good luck, Jesse. I hope you like being doomed. Totally do. Hmm. I'm going to stop you. You're going down, Aiden. I'm going to stop you. Not this time, Jesse. Out of my way, Reggie. It's Reginald. Come on, criminals. Time to see the founder. Jesse and accomplices. You have committed acts of wanton and illegal building, something specifically forbidden by our laws. Explain yourself. This could uh, still turn out okay. Are you kidding? I didn't know it was illegal. She does not sound friendly. But I didn't know it was against the law when we started to build. We were stranded. What were we supposed to do? Ignorance won't get you any favors. Aiden told me all about you, Jesse. About how you're a tyrant back home. About how you and your Order of the Stone steal all the world's treasures for yourself. About how you're here to steal the Eversource from my city. Aiden is just using That's you. Terrible act of treason. This is obviously all his lies. Master manipulator. He'd say anything to get his hands on the Eversource. Hmm. <laughs> Much like you would seem to be doing right now. Yes, Jesse, it's clear that you're the little ringleader. So how about you come with me? Um, okay. Ah, I guess we'll just wait here then. Hmm. Lovely out here. Tell me what you see. Sky. Um... I don't see anything. see anything. It's just empty. Precisely. As you can see, nothing exists below us. Only the void. So. Resources. Every kind are incredibly precious. And when something falls, it is gone forever. It is why building only happens when I dictate it. People only receive materials when I allow it. Otherwise, we would collapse back into chaos. It is my duty to keep my people safe. And the only way sense. I can do that is if our laws are obeyed. I guess that makes sense. How would you get anything new up here? I appreciate your trying to understand our world. <sighs> people act as though I want things to be this way. Allocating the limited resources. Risking my life every day. Um, uh, is the Eversource dangerous? Wait, risking your life? Is the Eversource dangerous? More than you could know. I'll have you know that before I found the Eversource, this world was nothing more than a cluster of pathetic islands in the sky. I do this for my people. That is why I do what I do. Uh... You don't have to don't do it alone. Need to do it alone. We can help the other ones to work together. <sighs> Being the leader of this city, it is a tiring burden. Uh, but no, this is my city. These are my people. And it is my responsibility. I think I've heard quite enough. Good. Now that you're back, we can talk properly. Reginald, I've made my decision. While I'm not convinced that you are here to steal the Eversource, the fact remains that you constructed a bridge of dirt without authorization. 
That is why you and your companions are to be detained <gasps> until I can discern the full truth of the matter. <laughs> Reginald, please remove them. Yes, ma'am. What? Oh, dear. Um... Uh... I wanted to help Come you. Come on, I wanted to help you. Don't do this. <sighs> I'm afraid this is the way it has to be. No. Sorry, outsiders. Founder's orders. No changing your mind now. Hopefully Petra and uh, Milo will uh, save us. I hope. You guys have some really fascinating stuff here. This up. You really need to confiscate our stuff, too? Well, it wouldn't be much of a jail if I let you keep your stuff. <laughs> I guess that's true. Oh, wow. That's a what is weird one. This? That's mine? It's almost like dirt, but not. It's, it's called, called sand. sand. Is it not sand? Have you ever seen sand before? Sand. Wow. What's it do? Are you kidding me? We are not going to explain sand to the guy locking us behind bars. I refuse. Well, whatever it does, it's going in the chest with everything else. <laughs> Nothing sand falls. Than an unimportant man. It makes on the you itch all over. Do you have to be? Hey, I don't have to take this. I'm in charge here. You're criminals. Aiden told everyone all about how horrible you are. He said that you burned down trees just for fun. That you steal all that. the world's treasures and hoard them for yourself. He also said that you tame wild animals just so you can make them chase innocent people. You can't believe a, a thing Aiden says. He's a liar. He said that you'd say that. <laughs> well, I suppose that's probably what a liar would say. I'm sorry, but this is the way it has to be. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go help the blaze rods beef up security. No. Can't believe I'm taking orders from that sniveling little... <clears throat> Stay here. Don't cause any trouble. I'm sure you'll be very comfortable. I promise I'm not lying. I promise I'm not lying. You can believe me. Really? Kind of seems like a your word versus their situation. Um, Blaze Rides are bad people. You've seen how they act. They're not good people. You know it. <sighs> okay. Let's say you make a good point. And I'm not saying you do. But hypothetically, why would I, Captain of the Guard, let you, a criminal, out of that cell. I'll never know how you looked at them and uh, thought, there are some upstanding We citizens. should be on the same side. I know that if you really think about it, you'll see. We should be on the same side here. We're the good guys. <clears throat> good guys, huh? I can tell you what's less free. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, let's say I'm heading to the pantry to get you prisoners some bread. Uh, we're gonna leave the door open? Maybe you'll forget to lock the door. Please just get out of here. Get to the throne room and stop the blaze rods. Reggie, he's so nice. Ha! Nice work! Now, on to the other source. I mean, I understand wanting to stop the blade. You can't still oh. really want to steal um, the Eversource, can you? I don't Honestly, want Aiden. I just Aiden. don't want Aiden to get his hands on the Eversource. So long as we stop him, that's what's important. Sounds good to me. No way Aiden would do anything good if he had it.
throne room was back this way. Okie dokie. Here we go. You have to beat Aiden to the Eversource. Or else. <clears throat> Here we go. We should find Petra and Milo first. Well, here we are, back in the throne room. Keep your voice down. We don't know if we're alone in here. I don't know. Looks deserted to me. <gasps> Milo. Uh, I was gonna stay quiet. You know who he is. Hey. Hey. Wait, is Milo stop. bad, actually? Milo, easy. That's Jesse and Lucas. Jesse, I can't believe we found you! I can't believe you punched me. Um, yes, I feel absolutely terrible about that. What are you Let doing? Sure. Petra, what in the world are you doing here? We were actually planning to break you out of jail, but I guess you guys have that covered. Hello again, Jesse. It seems fate has destined uh, our paths to cross once more. I had hoped this would be the case. Or, hey, you're that in weird innkeeper guy. Ha, <laughs> well, that is my day job. In actuality, I'm the leader of a group that wants the same thing you do. It's a rebellion. It is a long story. In short, my people want to free the Eversource from the Founder's clutches so that everyone may use it. If Aiden and his blaze rods steal the Eversource, we'll just be trading one tyrant for another. And I won't allow that. Yeah, he's got to be stopped. If we work together, we can mm. find it first. Welcome aboard. Milo, I'm happy to have you aboard. Welcome to the team. I'm very pleased to be involved. Milo seems like a good guy. secret entrance is supposed to be somewhere in this throne room. Yeah, there was a door here before with a minecart. Yeah, what happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's got to be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap. Gotcha. That sounds easy, even though levers are like my enemy. Um, bookcase. Let's kind of. I thought I saw something. Maybe can we like look behind the book? That'd be a good spot to hide a lever. I didn't really pay attention if they did like pull lever. The By Soren? Wow, well, how'd that get here? Soren? No. Let's read about Shorin, the order, the old order. Uh, the view, no, that won't really help. Everything over here. So you got a cobblestone generator. Some water. Got an eyebor. Um, let's see. It's definitely, oh, it's hit on the throne. Maybe it'll like give us a new perspective. Jesse, what are you doing? Ha, huh, sorry. Oh man, I thought it was gonna give us like a new perspective to look at the room. Um, okay, Petra's on lookout, let's not bother her. Lucas, let's see, where's Milo? I wanna see, maybe he might know. Um, where to find a lever, cause he lives here, so maybe he has a little bit more knowledge than we do. Uh, okay, what else do we, all can we look at? The lock, the block doorway. A lever slot, ooh. If I had a lever, this would be the perfect spot for it. Huh. Oh, so do we need to find the lever? Uh, okay, so like a chest we could look in? Let's talk, oh, here's Milo, let's talk to Milo. So do you have, like, any underground rebel type secrets? That could help us out here? Uh, I'm afraid not. Though I will certainly tell you, if I think of any. Hmm. Doesn't seem like he knows much. Crap. Ooh! What if we found materials? <gasps> Idea! Okay, here's a tree. I get the feeling this is a special tree. Yes, the ground you're standing on is actually the original island that all of Sky City started from. That tree dropped the saplings that grew into every tree on the island. 
I may not agree with the Founder's methods, but even I must admit, that's an impressive feat. Well, that is pretty special. Cut it down. No, okay, we need some cobblestone. Wait, can we go over here? Okay, we need cobblestone because then we can make like a cobble, like we can crack the lever and place it down. Huh. A cobblestone generator. Amazing! Lava and water. Placed exactly far enough that when they collide, it creates cobblestone. Genius! Did you not know that? Pretty... Yes, okay, grab. There we go. Heavy. That is ingenious. <laughs> now we need the tree. Can we get that tree or do we have to come over to this one? I need a tree. I need wood. So let's see if we can come over here. Take up that tree. <laughs> Please, I just need wood. Uh, I don't have wood on me. Oh wait, dead bush. Don't dead bushes give you sticks? Like in 1.9 they change it to where a dead bush can give you sticks. Bush. Barely more than a bundle of sticks. Come on. Yes, okay. Hopefully it's up to date with 1.9. Yes. Thank you, 1.9. I think that should be everything I need to make a lever now. Here we go, okay. Thank you, 1.9. Okay, let's you did do it. this. Okay. Uh now. Okay, cobblestone. I feel so accomplished. Okay, <laughs> that was stick. Next lever. Ah, my old friend, the lever. Fantastic. Yeah. Didn't know you were watching. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities. You and your friend Petra have been very inspiring to me and my people. With your help. We may finally liberate ourselves from the Founder's Clutches. Okay, so now we need to head on over to the, uh, to the place and place the lever. Okay, let's use it. Here we go! Source, here we come. Spoopy. To the Eversource. Oh dear, this is a little dangerous. Oh, over here. This is a bit dangerous. Wow, look Ooh. at all these chests. Yeah. Us lads. Creeper, zombie, sheep, pigman. Can we like spawn eggs? What does it mean? Open it. Spawn eggs, I bet you. Huh. I knew it. Eggs. The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot. It'll give you a sheep. Obviously. Watch. Watch this, guys. Boom. Sheep. Just hold a my sheep. Is is that a monster? That's not so bad. It is fluffy. <gasps> the eggs all have sheep. creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color coded what's in them. So Don't ask she what? can just spawn things whenever uh, she wants to. The ever so source, the source makes, makes these spawn egg things. Yeah, I mean Stay never. On your toes. Come. We're close. Ah, the Eversource must be like creative mode. Let's take a look you. around. What if we get trapped in creative mode and then we can like troll everyone? Hmm, that'd be funny. Okay, no, go back. Go back. Let me put oh, I want the ocelot eggs. Ooh. The ocelots. Yeah. Oh, it's, um... hey, what is that? It's awesome. It's a chicken. A very derpy looking chicken. But it's a chicken. Incredible! Uh, it's a chicken? Ever source is a chicken? What? Yes. The spawn eggs. It's so simple. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. That's the ever source? So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make 
monsters and the loot from the monsters made this place. We'll throw it in the minecart and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? So the ever source is a chicken that needs spawning. Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people. With it, we'll finally be free of the founder. But that clucking thing is what we uh, came for. The people well, should have right. it. The Eversource belongs to the people. What? I thought that was the whole point of this adventure. Well, do bad. Hey, where we learned the truth about, truth, yeah, truth about this place. <gasps> this is the founder. I knew it. I knew you were here to steal from me. Uh, <laughs> she? Pain. Uh, She's too fast. Let's talk about this. Hang on a second. Let's talk about this, okay? I'm not sure there's anything to talk about. It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic order. Oh, uh, this does make us look kind of guilty. You don't say. What? No. Uh, don't believe that. You have the wrong idea. She'll just be crying. Oh, it's just that he's back in though. This is ridiculous. It's all lies. And I'm supposed to believe the escaped convicts? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves. And here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep, I'm afraid <gasps> I'm going to be taking the chicken. Do you know? What? This is outrageous. Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs. Creeper! Oh! Oh, that was gonna hit me. Creeper, look out! No! Oh, sheep. Oh, poor sheep. Save the founder. Oh, you got me, Lucas. Uh. Say founder. Gotcha. Obviously, Lucas can hang on. Oh, Lucas can hang on for a minute. I mean, founder's more important. Thank you. Thank you. Ah! Lucas! Lucas, no! Does this kill him? No, Lucas, don't die. <gasps> no, now we all fall! That chicken. Slow motion. I'll take it from here. No! That was not expected. Oh, what should have I done? I bet this would have happened either way. I feel like one of the choices could have kept us from falling into the void. Um, but at least we didn't die. Oh. It's bottomless, you can't. This is all your fault! Thanks um, to you, we get to see what really happens when you fall off the ice. Doesn't matter. Well, playing the blame game doesn't exactly do a lot of good right now. What does it matter? It matters because my entire city is doomed thanks to you. Hmm, I can't decide whether I want our death to be painless Wait, for my sake or land. excruciating for yours. <gasps> land! He's not a void. Impossible. That's impossible. Jesse? There. Can we get to it in time? It's gonna be close. Ooh. Figure out. Okay. Fly. Glide. Glide. We can do this. Don't die. What about the founder? Is she okay? Will she make it? Okay, I think I'm on track. Let's just kind of stay up here. Okay, well, this is fun. It's scary but fun at the same time. Hey, the sheep made it! Ha! Jesse? Lucas! Holy crap, you're down here too? Lucas, you made it! Oh, yeah, only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, uh... it's tougher than I remember. But you're okay. Yeah, pretty good. I'm just so glad you're okay. When Aiden pitched you over the side, that was awful. Wait, Petra, yeah, Ivor, and Milo are stuck up there still. Ah. That was good of you to try and save the founder. Uh, speaking of whom, is she okay? 
she's just... Oh, I don't think she's seen everything down there. Uh, let me ask. Founder? Miss Founder? I, uh, hope she's not in shock. Um... Wow, I guess so, ground. guess you were wrong, huh? About there being no ground. I had no idea. How... How could I have known? <sighs> this has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. This will well, change everything. Well, it's going to be a pretty big game changer for you guys. I mean, it's going to change everything. Yes. Look at this place. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's all a little hmm. overwhelming. Never came here with the wither storm. What do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few uh, deep breaths? <laughs> bring everyone down here. You bring all your people down here. They they won't have to to petition for resources or any of that stuff anymore. I I suppose you're right. Yes, we have to go back up and tell them. Good. Okay, guys, I want to end it here. Uh, I don't have a random time, but we're running out of time this episode. Um, yeah, next episode, what we'll be doing is probably bring them, bringing them down, and then probably stopping. Uh, uh, Aiden, because he has to be stopped. He's evil. Um, but yeah, hope you guys all enjoyed this episode. Like it if you liked it, share it if you liked it, and subscribe if you want to see some more Minecraft story mode. But until the next episode, I hope you guys all enjoy. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys all later. Bye!